contest, please give it up for Texas Wrestling Cartel ring announcer, Deathmatch Dose! We want to get up there and talk tonight! Let's get it, baby! There is one promotion in Corpus that brings you the best action, the fastest fights, the biggest, biggest brawls, and that's Texas Wrestling Cartel! We are the promotion! Now for something a little different. <laughs> Deathmatch Dose is one of a kind, man. This is the show, Texas Indie Showcase, where we get all walks of life from the Texas independent scene here in Pasadena, Texas. Wrestling fans, if you are not familiar with the protagonist of professional wrestling herself, Kid Bandit, you better make yourself familiar. And you are in for a sight here tonight, ladies and gentlemen, our semi-main event of the evening. On behalf of the Texas Wrestling Cartel Showcase, Kid Bandit is going one-on-one -on -one with the young and up-and-coming power glider, Eddie Martinez. Bandit is a rascal. She loves chaos. And their opponent. Martinez, Bandit may be his antagonist here tonight. Of course, Kid Bandit, no stranger to holding championship gold in her short career in professional wrestling, especially here in the state of Texas. A former Metroplex Wrestling Prospects champion holding that championship for about 63 days. Of course, Kid Bandit knows exactly what it takes to become champion, not just in professional wrestling, but here in the state of Texas. Well, there she's a, a hey, female trying to take the championship from the official before the match even starts. I mean, by a lot of classifications, still a rookie in wrestling is Kid Bandit. It's, it's, it's insane. Absolutely. A little over two years of in-ring competition experience, a martial arts background, trained at the Nightmare Factory by WWE superstar Cody Rhodes in AEW's own QT Marshall as well as the fine folks at Santino Bros Wrestling Academy. Eddie Martinez, however, a Texas native straight out of DFW All-Pro Wrestling Academy, Coach Lou Gotti. You'll happen to notice a lot of similarities in the styles between Kid Bandit and Eddie Martinez, but a lot of differences. Kid Bandit likes to have fun, likes to have a good time. Eddie Martinez, 
looks to be at least a little apprehensive towards those. He should be. <laughs> he absolutely should be. Shenanigans will yep. be afoot. Yep. How much of that's going to get into the mind of the power glider in this match? Now this collar and elbow tie-up is ensued. Kid Bandit and Eddie Martinez. Martinez definitely more likely to wrestle in a Lucha Libre style. Very high-paced, high-action. Kid Bandit knows exactly how to keep up with those sorts of methodations. As Bandit taking the side headlock of her own. Well, the, the training from Santino Brothers will come in the, the handy there. Do we still call them educated feet? That's definitely what Kid Bandit has. Especially with that martial arts background mentioned earlier on in the broadcast. Eddie Martinez and Kid Bandit back and forth here. Nice move by Bandit there. You have to respect the tenacity. Like we said, only a little over two years in ring experience for Kid Bandit, yet somehow highly acclaimed inside that squared circle. Uh, absolutely. There's no story like it. No story like it at all. We, we talked about how quickly uh, Vert Vixen picked up pro wrestling. Kid Bandit is just on a different wavelength. It's amazing. And about that one, Kid Bandit, both of these two competitors coming to strikes here. Duck underneath with a clothesline. Kid Bandit, sunset flip, rolling through, cover. Rolling through again. Could have had a new TWC champion. Oh, nobody home on that kick. Yeah, Martinez rolling through. I, I don't think that there's a way that Eddie could have prepared for the speed. If he lets that overwhelm him, here's those feet. Fooled me. We're seeing definitely fooled me. Consistent pinning attempts combined with high octane bursts of energy. That's how Kid Bandit likes to navigate the squared circle. That burst of energy is truly what fuels her inside the ring. It, it's a different speed, right? It's definitely a different speed. It's definitely helped propel her to the heights that she's gone on early in her career so far. Absolutely, all across the state of Texas and beyond, representing TWC here tonight. But will she leave representing Texas Wrestling Cartel as champion? That will be uh, making the drive to Austin for the, um, the Styles War event tomorrow. Keep an eye out for that one. Indie War, or Indie War. Uh, IWTV as well. Yeah, put yourself, put your stuff over, man. <laughs> Martinez and Kid Bandit. Consistent back and forth action. Open handed palm strike to the side of the skull of Bandit. Bandit off the ropes there. No one home on that clothesline. Bandit catching with a head scissors takeover right there. Very Full nice. speed and ferocity for Kid Bandit. Electrifying the audience here. Bandit going for that Tiger faint kick, but Martinez out of the way. Rolling through. Sit out flatliner. Stay on top of it. Martinez on top of it. As you mentioned, only the two count, though. Of course, with the championship on the line, no hesitancy within the movements of Eddie Martinez. And you cannot have hesitancy as a defending champion. Yeah, you can't admire his work, right? Very nice to turn the tables there, get that move, but you can't sit back and say, hey, look at that great thing I did. Not in a matchup of this caliber, not in a matchup with an opponent like Kid Bandit. Kid Bandit up and over here, Eddie Martinez. Shocked in confusion. Caught to the side of the skull. And notice how Bandit, she takes this burst of energy and then slows it back down to size. Bandit is controlling time in this matchup. It's working very well in her favor. She's in charge of the pace, right? Absolutely. Eddie Martinez. Oh, right now, Martinez is in charge with a brutal drop kick, Mr. sending Bandit all the way to the corner. Mr. Vroom Vroom, the power glider, is going to be looking to pick up the pace. Martinez taking his time here. Might be costing him though. Kid Bandit front chancery down into the swinging neck breaker. Neck breaker for Kid Bandit. I think that's the difference in the two strategies right now. Kid Bandit is sticking and moving, changing the speed to uh, take advantage of Eddie Martinez. Eddie Martinez is, is trying to think of what's next. Well, it looks like Kid Bandit took a lot out on herself right there with that chop. Martinez 
Ducky underneath the chop. Kid Bandit spin a kick. Kick to the right side of the skull. Look at the delay. Signature oh, God. for Kid oh, Bandit. My God. Straight to the mush. Into the cover. Two. Nearly Dude. had it. Do not expect Kid Bandit to play by the rules. Any, any of them. Any rule. The energy that Kid Bandit brings to the squared circle knows no boundaries. Bandit bringing that energy to Eddie Martinez, but not in the form he's going to be looking for. She gets chatting with the crowd. If she gets in that mojo, you are in deep, deep trouble. It is just a wave of action. Deep trouble Eddie Martinez is in right now. We're starting to see the world travel experience of Kid Bandit come into play. Traveling all across the United States of America as well as countries such as Japan and Mexico. Incredible entering competitor rolling through those. Eddie Martinez, shoulders. Shoulders were not down, according to referee Killian Powers. A couple of Euro European excursions as well. Definitely. Seen all the styles. And a student of the game, too. That's why you'll notice a, an intertwining of all of those styles for Kid Bandit. And Martinez looking to learn a thing or two, stepping into the ring with Bandit here tonight, and use it into his own advantage. Martinez off the ropes. Drop kick. Shooting Bandit down to the center of the canvas cover for the TWC Championship, no! Just that close was Eddie Martinez to retaining his championship. Bandit also mixes in some studies of other martial arts, things that most wrestlers don't study. That's where you get a lot of the unorthodox. Uh... We talk a lot about the youth of Kid Bandit. Eddie Martinez, very young in his professional career as well. Also a little under. Two years of in-ring experience for Martinez. Now look, we're talking about two individuals that have two or, or just a little under two years experience. What is Killian Powers? Brain buster! And, and Powers wanted nothing to do with that. This is not a tag team affair. Cover! It's the magic of Kid Bandit. The man. resourcefulness of utilizing another person that's in the ring, in this case the official, to aid Kid Bandit. I think Kid Bandit wanted to help Killian Powers become the new TWC champion. Bandit off the ropes, sent to the outside. Oh, oh. That's called missing your target if I've ever seen it. Martinez off the ropes. Oh, Kick to the side of the skull. Got him right in the face. Well, I don't know if we're allowed to proclaim that on air, but. Kid Bandit has some bad intentions for Eddie Martinez. A lot of leeway on IWTV. You know what type of stuff they put on here? Bandit now giving Martinez a seat. Everybody getting a seat. Getting some, uh, some front row assistance. Oh my. It's a big kick to the face. Yeah, just got some assistance rearranging his teeth. Uh, Eddie Martinez might need a dental assistant after that. The Bandit rolling in, breaking the count, going right back to the outside, not finished with the fun. Yeah, this is Bandit's world. You know, we talked about Bandit not never being one to exactly adorn herself to rule books. This crowd absolutely eating all of it up. Bandit. Oh! Well, that, that does hurt. Effective as well. Eddie Martinez has to be in astronomical pain. This is not looking good for the Texas Wrestling Cartel Champion. This is the chaos he, he needed to prepare for. It does not look like he was ready. There's no preparation when you're stepping into the ring with Kid Bandit. You know that just as well as I do. Thank you, Woo! Kid Bandit, oh my, met with a big drop kick, sending her back to the outside. The power glider off the ropes. Looking to go to the outside. Catches her with a 
big suicide dive. Desperation right there by the power glider after enduring a lot of punishment to the outside. And we talked about the power glider being fluent in the Lucha Libre stylings that were taught to him by Coach Lugatti at DFW All Pro Academy. Eddie Martinez utilizing those to become TWC champion in the first slice. Can he retain tonight? Bandit by Woman's Carry on the shoulders. Martinez trying to go for a snapmare of swords. Martinez Ooh. with a shot to the skull, knocking Bandit Loopy. What is this? Innovative offense from Martinez. Elevated, oh, trying to go my. for the cutter. The cross arm breaker applied. The cross arm breaker. Variation of the, the mouse trap there. Very nice. Bandit. The front face lock. Good God, the cross face locked in. It, and the hands are over the eyes. Eddie Martinez is just so close to the ropes, he needs to reach. But he has no idea because of the, the hand grasp right there. The eyes are being covered by Kid Bandit on that face lock. Martinez has absolutely no idea where he could be right now. And all he can do is exactly what's happening now, crawling any direction. Yeah. He, he bridged up his neck, which gave him enough room to look through the, the fingers and see the rope there. That was a, a very wise move by Eddie. Agree. The bandit looking to create some separation, re-strategize, regain plan at this current time in our match. Don't piss off bandit, man. Do not piss off bandit. Turns in kind. Oh, catches that third kick right there from Bandit. Oh! Martinez had Bandit well scouted. Superwoman punch! Oh, oh my, my god. Martinez! Trying to go for that insecurity, rolling over. Oh my, big knee straight to the face. Knee strike from Bandit. Waist lock roll through. Kick to the head right there from Martinez. They're throwing bombs right now. Beautiful Listo kick. The ropes, Bandit, Martinez. It is back and forth. Who's going to be the first one to make a mistake? It looks like Martinez may be the one. Bandit off the ropes. Tiger faint kick. Pasadena, Texas is a Bandit country here tonight. Bandit. Oh, oh, Martinez caught her with the cutter. Caught out of midair for the championship. Not so fast, my friends. Not so fast. Bandit keeping the hopes alive. But for how much longer can Bandit maintain to keep those hopes alive, gentlemen? Well, as the match progresses on and time keeps elapsing. Survive in advance. Survive in advance. Got to believe that time cannot be on the side of either one of these competitors the longer this goes. One of those kicks lands flush, we get a new champion. Martinez was attempting some high-risk, high-octane action. Never works well when you're caught on the other side of it. Bandit with the electric chair positioning for Martinez. Double underhook. Front face lock up and down with the Falcon Arrow. The deal is done, Martinez. Oh, Bandit sliding out at a count of one. And a look of rage on her face, but oh, it's met with a foot from Martinez. The fighting spirit of Kid Bandit is undying, but Martinez might have had this one won. That's it, that's it. And he stepped up, guys.
Martinez. 